In Excel 2007, charts and charting are more powerful than in any other release of Excel. Now Excel offers new and improved tools and functionality for charting. Creating a chart is as easy as ever. When a chart is the active element on a worksheet, you are presented with a new ribbon feature called the Chart Tools. The Chart Tools is comprised of three tabs. You have the Design tab, Layout, and Format. Through the use of the Charts, Tools, Design, Layout, and Format tabs, you can easily customize the appearance and layout and design of your chart. If you are familiar with previous releases of Excel, the Chart Tools and these three tabs contain many of the commands that were accessible in dialog boxes, tabs, and panels in previous releases of Microsoft Excel. Microsoft has also added many new built-in design and layout styles for charting. You'll see here on the Design tab, we now have Chart Layouts and Chart Styles, and we'll be covering those later in this course. Chart Templates are now available and can easily be applied to a chart. As you can see, professional charts are just a few clicks away. Also new with Excel 2007 is Shared Charting. Shared Charting means that a chart can now be shared between Excel, Word, and PowerPoint. In prior releases of Microsoft Office, charts were created by Microsoft Graph for both Word and PowerPoint, whereas Excel used a worksheet to contain the charting data sheet. Now Microsoft Office charts are generated using Excel's chart data sheet for both Word and PowerPoint. Charts can be easily shared between the Microsoft Office product suite by just copying and pasting. When pasted in Word or PowerPoint, the chart can retain the Excel chart format if it is embedded or it will be automatically changed to match the Word and PowerPoint format. You will learn more about these new features later in this chapter. All these features make charting more powerful than ever in Excel 2007. Let's move on to the next movie.